Montana's congressional delegation took the lead today in helping celebrate the lighting of the U.S. Capitol Christmas tree. It took place just a few hours ago. If you recall, this year's tree comes from Montana's Kootenai National Forest. It arrived in Washington, D.C. two weeks ago. Tonight, Q2's David Jay joins us with more on the big lighting ceremony today. David. Well, Jay, uh, Senator John Tester, Senator Steve Daines, Congressman Greg Gianforte, and House Speaker Paul Ryan each spoke about Larry Speakermeyer, who drove the tree more than 3,000 miles from Yak in the northwestern part of the state. Speaker Ryan counted down to the lighting. Five, four, three, two, one. 11-year-old Ridley Brandmeyer of Bozeman had the honor of lighting the tree. The tree is a 79-foot tall Engelman spruce and has some um, uh, 3,500 ornaments. The Christmas tree tradition on the Capitol's West Lawn started in 1964. This tree is more than a symbol of the natural resources of the Treasure State. It is our shared history intertwined with our outdoor heritage and our Montana values. It is an example of what happens when this nation works together toward a common goal. It is a symbol of unity this Christmas season. If there's any service members from Montana, either here or watching from afar, as Montanans, we are proud of this tree, but we're even prouder of you. And I want to thank you for our service to our great country. May the people's tree from under Montana's big sky be a sign of good cheer. May it and the star adorning it serve as a beacon of hope that brings us together. Montana also received the honor of providing the Capitol tree in 1989 and 2008. Wyoming sent a tree in 2010. The tree will be lit each night until 11 o'clock uh, through January 1st of 2018. Jay? 